Welcome to Global Eats and Treats! Wow! I'm excited. I have a cold, you guys, so I can't taste very well. So today's Global Eats and Treats is brought to you by nobody, not a sponsor. And yes, Callie is sick, so it'll be up to me to determine where things are from. Callie's just gonna try things and they're all gonna taste the same. Do I want to breathe on you? I'll try to stay away. Yeah, don't don't breathe on me. It's my new magic wand. That, it keeps the sick away. First one? Okay. First one. Sounds like pepper granules. It sounds like a bunch of nerds. Oh, nerds! Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. He's a shaker. Maracas, it's from Mexico. It is like nerds. No, -uh, really? Yeah. Oh! <gasps> but it looks like really giant dried up nerds. I wonder, do you think they're gonna be sour or sweet? Or do you think they're gonna be plain tasting because you're sick? Sour. Do sour. we just wanna, I'm gonna try one color of each. It's definitely a sour candy, I'm betting. It's nerds, <laughs> wait. Not nerds. Is it gum? Oh, it's gum. I'm gonna swallow it. No, it's not gum. Sure? Yeah. Where could this be from, though? It's, it's not really gum. Oh. I'm the map. 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 Thanks, Dora. Swiper, no swiping. They're not sour. No, they're, they're sweet. Good. It's a hard candy. It's kind of like, uh, it's kind of like if Runts and Nerds met. Yeah. Oh, right? perfect combination. Yeah, yeah. It's not bad. I would snack on these probably mindlessly while I was watching Netflix. Stranger Things coming out soon. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna say Brazil. I'm gonna say the U.S. You're just gonna say USA, huh? This would that be that I haven't tried before in the U.S. Global Eats and Treats right here in the United States of America. You ready? Thank you again to JD for uh, putting oh. this together. I'm just gonna. Oh, he got it. Oh, it's China. Pasquez. Tara Oodles mix from China. I know that China always has fun candy. I think that's what we need to go off of now. If it's got colorful fun, it's probably from China or Japan. Depends the palette. Oh yeah. He's supposed to have his Pringles cup. I get lots of comments on this. Do you really? Yes. On the Pringles cup, huh? I think people look at me quite funny when they don't comment as well. <laughs> and I'm embarrassed. Yeah. <laughs> I would snack on these. You want to be the good pile this time? Good pile. Next one. Pile. Ting! That was magic. It sounds like two individual things. It's two pieces. I could really go for some chocolate. I'm hoping it's something chocolatey. What? Did we have these before? I feel like we've had these before. We've probably guys. had these before. If they're the pizza sticks. Pretzel sticks, pizza stick. Oh, look at the end of them. It's, this is like hockey. They're chocolate filled. Yeah, yeah, okay. I like the outer flavor. It tastes like a pretzel, but the inside is chocolate! Woo! It tastes like a hot chocolate drink in an edible... In an edible form? Yeah. This could be... It's it like, tastes just like hot chocolate. When I was a kid, I always wanted to have those, like, straws that you could... Drink out. ...eat, but also... What were the big, like, the big round ones? They were the Hershey straws. Yeah, well, Hershey's those, but they had, like, the, uh, pirouettes? No, that's not what it is. Oh, okay. pr pyroline, pr pruline. So, I don't even know. Anyway, if you know what it is, you know what I'm talking about. But this is what that reminds me of. Whatever that is. You like it. It's going to my desk. Oh, yeah, so when we're done, people ask, like, where the treats go, because obviously they didn't send us two of these. That we've got a whole pack full of them. We so share Callie's, them at the office usually. We usually do, but. unless we like them, then we get to keep them. Uh -huh. You can keep it. I I like it, but I wouldn't eat it too often. Where's it's usually from, from? It's a Japanese thing. I'm just gonna say South Korea. I mean, I feel like it's leading us to believe that it could be Pocky. I or, love it. It's not bad, it's really good. I'm gonna go Thailand. Thailand? And I chose what again? Pocky. <laughs> I chose South Dakota. No! <laughs> Just South Korea. Is that an accident or did you really that was, it? No, that was totally an accident. Tell us where it's from. Oh my gosh. What? It's from Thailand. No way, shut up. It's called Lati Tapo Vanilla oh. Chocolate Pretzel Sticks from Thailand. Callie got it right. Is it sad that she's sick and I <laughs> I didn't get it, but she like, got it? Like, I didn't it? think I could taste today, but I'm not having such a hard time. Wow, so that's one for Callie. She yeah. gets to keep it. You like the, because I feel like the last time we had a Thailand snack, you really liked it too. Hmm. I thought that egg yolk thing was Thailand and it wasn't No, egg. I don't think that was Thailand. We got two good ones so far. Next one. Mm. What's it gonna be? <laughs> Shake it. Paper. Sounds like a whisk against 
aluminum foil. JD does such a good job, like. He does a way better job than Steve. <gasps> don't say that. Steve, Steve, don't quit your day job, but you're really good at it too. Hey, there's the writing on it, you can tell where it's oh, from. Oh, no, no, yeah, you can't. Yeah, he should have unwrapped it. No, that's all right. It's okay. You can't tell where this is from. That's like Chinese writing. That could be Korean. Wow, a burst of flavor. Like you'd bite into it at first, it's kind of like a starburst, a little bit harder, but it's one of those things where the flavor, is, it just hit you, didn't it? It's like sour. Because it's so much flavor. That is really flavorful. Where is it from? You just really had that passcode. <laughs> that was like the easiest passcode ever. <laughs> Shut up. Where could this be from? I'm gonna say Japan. You can say Japan, I'm gonna go back to South Korea. I think I'm gonna say every single one is from South Korea till I get it right. South Korea? It's called Crown Seikom Dalcom. I, we're probably butchering it, I'm sorry. From? South Korea. Woo! We're tied. Ow! Ow! They hit my knuckle on the wall the other day and I have a really big bruise Yeah, there. I forgot that I'm the wall. I would snack on these because I like the fruity. They're kind of creamy too, or is that just my cold? No, 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 no. You're, it, you're right, because it's, it's kind of smooth after you've yeah. chewed on it for a while. What am I doing? <laughs> Magic. Magic! Sounds like nerds again. Sounds like our nerds. I'm still chewing on the last one. Whoa. I don't want to do it. That's going to be hot. I don't want to do it. This looks like really super hot spicy Cheeto chunks. Like little bitty Cheeto chunks. That's probably exactly what it is. Oh yeah. Totally can smell it. What if it's one of those things that's like the chip challenge? What's that chip Oh, called? Oh, the, the, uh, the devil's chip. The devil's foot. I don't want to go toe. to the ER for. You won't. I don't think it's going to be that hot. Um, it smells like buffalo. Kind does of. it? I love buffalo. Oh, it totally does. Will you go first? Yeah. If it's, too, if it's way too spicy. But I'm, I like spicy. Just get in the female mindset. Is it going to be too hard to handle? Don't make fun of me. Your eyes are watering. No, they're not. It might be a little too spicy. Try, try just like a little bit of one. It has a little bit of a bite. It tastes like the like lemon, like the chili fire. It's not a bad flavor, but you're gonna feel a little bit of the bite. Yeah. It's already biting. Yeah, and you just licked it. Flaming hot Cheetos, but it's got like a lemon flavor to it. I or lime I, flavor. I wish I could eat it. It would clear out your sinuses. Yeah, and my intestines. <laughs> I will I will pass. Okay, but okay. It's spicy. It is it is spicy. I just had one and I can still feel the burn in my throat. You can. Yep. Okay, and that's how little they are. And it's small. It's definitely Cheetos. Flames coming out. I wish. That'd be sweet. Do you think it's Cheetos brand? It's Cheetos. Why aren't they like in Cheeto form? Well, you see, well, Maybe it could be like bag? Cheeto, Cheeto bits. Oh, that's the best part of the Cheeto bag though when you're done with the Is that the end of it? And you just, just shake it's the, the best, rest. It's the best part of any chip bag. Um. Spicy. I'm gonna, cause I know that Mexico. Chile. Yeah. Oh, no, Mexico. I know that Mexico, they have a lot of candy that's very fun and spicy and mm -hmm. foreign. So I'm gonna guess it's it's from Mexico. I'm gonna go to Canada. Just cause? Do you think they have spicy Cheetos, flaming they, hot Cheetos? Do you think they have a different they, kind of Cheetos? They could. They, they're the ones that had like the ketchup chips and stuff, so it doesn't wouldn't surprise me. All right, you ready? Mexico. It's Cheetos. Cheetos flaming hot shots. Oh, hot shots, like little pieces. Like a little piece, and then that's good, Warren. I got you're, two you're right. You're winning. Don't punch. Yes. I should be more excited, but I, I feel like I still feel Arriba, the burn a little bit. Arriba. 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 All right, that's a good pile. That, I I will I would snack on it, but I wouldn't have too much of it. There's some weight to this, so I'm guessing chocolate. Should I should I get like a big ego now that I've gotten like twice, like correct twice? <laughs> I know exactly where this is from, and I haven't even seen it yet. Is that really? This is going to be from Jamaica, Sweden. I love chips. Another chip. They look like barbecue chips, guys. I think, I think they know. I think they've been listening because they know you like the salty and, and sweet and crunchy. They smell like barbecue chips. I don't think we've had. Oh, I'm um, Have we had them before? No. They taste like soy sauce. What? Oh my gosh. No, it just tastes like barbecue flavor. That's like soy sauce, it, Asian. It tastes like the Lay is barbecue flavor. Nope. There's like Thai food or Asian in this. An Asian tie to it, huh? Mm-hmm. I like them. I'm just tasting Lay's barbecue. Maybe, maybe you got a different chip. I don't know. Well, where do you think it's from? Because I already know where it's from. Because I've gotten twice, gotten it right twice. I don't know. 
I'll say Canada. I'll take. I'll steal Cali's. I'll steal Cali's, and I'll say Canada. A. A. Calais. What are you thinking? What are you thinking? I'm gonna go to Canada too, but I'm gonna say that. That's like, fine. Barbecue Thai chip or something, or which would be so, soy saucy. I don't know Asian where you're chip. tasting the soy sauce. It's, it's strange. I've got a cold too. That is true, and you've gotten one right with a cold, and I give you major props for that. It is called the Crokey Paprika chip from Paprika. Oh, Paprika. Yeah. From the Netherlands. I wouldn't have guessed that. I would never have guessed it. So I can see then, though, where you're tasting kind of the foreign flavor then. I just taste the barbecue chip. When I like something, I dance when I eat it. I do. You're not You're not alone. There's a lot of people who like take a bite and they'll be like, mm-hmm. I want to see the packaging. Okay. So, uh, by the way. A, A++. Really, really good. I want to stop eating them. Every one of our snacks this week or this month, I would have eaten. I, yeah. I mean, once I tried it a little bit. Thank you again for our uh, Global Eats and Treats. Callie's gonna go eat the rest of those and we'll see you again uh, next month.